Well, it's been almost a year since the Samson Flatbush fire, which severely affected Adelaide. In the months since, the regrowth and recovery has created a new opportunity. One local high school is teaching students the finer points of winemaking. Paul Clark knows what it's like to start again. He operates Kersbrook Hill Winery, where the Samson Flat fire destroyed his vineyards and buildings. It was that loss that gave Birdwood High School teacher Lauren Smith the idea to help by donating wine grapes tended by her students. I kind of thought we'd just donate the grapes and, and help out that way and that would be it. And then Paul phoned up and said, oh, if you want to uh, get the students involved, we'd love to have them help with some of the processes. So it's become a huge learning activity for them. For Paul Clark, it made perfect sense to help agricultural science students increase their vineyards output. From our point of view, if you're going to be in a community like this, you've, it's a two-way street. You've got to put back into it as well. So um, it was a no-brainer for us, really. They were helping us. It's best we help them. It's a dynamic not lost on his students. I was involved in the Samson Flat bushfire, so, you know, I definitely like the idea of it and being able to go back into the community and help, um, you know, so it's definitely, and it's also a learning curve too, you know, I've learnt so much. Birdwood High School is also optimistic that work in its vineyard can be parlayed into academic results. So we're going to hopefully build to even bigger and better things and um, have it so that the students can actually do SACE units in the winemaking industry as well. Paul Clark believes the students are also better off with a hands-on approach to their work and they agree it's helped them learn. That was kind of what we're setting out to do is take those theories and make them practical and uh, so this year they'll get four or five tonnes with a bit of luck and that starts to get up to a reasonable volume. We knew what we were doing but we, weren't, we didn't know what we were doing so we just kind of winged it <laughs> I guess you could say and we yeah this year we've gotten a lot of out a lot out of what we're doing. And that's the sort of goodwill they can sell by the bottle. Chris McLaughlin, ABC News, Adelaide. Thanks.